And she is our face, and she's our heart. She's the one who reminds us always, with a good heart, you do your job. The she that longtime Red Cross volunteer Betty Jumanville is talking about is Adams County Red Cross Executive Director Pam Schaefer. After taking over the reins in 1991, Schaefer says she will leave that post in March. Among her many accomplishments, Schaefer says she is proudest of creating the chapter's first disaster services program. I'm so proud of our volunteers that not only respond here locally in all 11 counties, but they also go out on national assignments, and uh, I'm really proud of that accomplishment. Two years later, that program would prove its worth during the flood of 93. We had volunteers from all over the country that came in to help us out. We had 12 emergency response vehicles here in our community that was feeding all the way from Hancock County down to Pike County. We were doing uh, two meals a day. Adams County Emergency Management Director John Simon was a 14-year-old Red Cross volunteer in 1993. Whether it's been flooding, whether it's been large snowstorms or windstorms, uh, the Lima tornado, we've always seen uh, her right at the front of the line being there to make sure that the community uh, was taken care of in, in a time of need. But Schaefer is characteristically humble, preferring always to turn the spotlight onto others. It wasn't, it wasn't me. I was leading, but it was due to all the volunteers that helped me provide those services. Pam Schaefer's eight grandchildren grace the wall of her office, and she says she's looking forward to spending more grandma time with them. Stephen Johnson, KHQA News, Quincy.